Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I just wanted to give a quick reminder, Glossy Box 2020 Advent Calendar giveaway is still going on my channel. If you want to enter, please subscribe and like and comment on the last video, the Glossy Box giveaway video, and you can also go over to my Instagram to get more entries. So guys, this is my first like Christmassy vlog. Who's excited for the holidays? I am, 100%, I can't wait. I'm doing a sort of gift guide. It's not really a gift guide, but it is gift ideas more so than a gift guide because I've already wrapped half my Christmas presents. So this is just mainly a lot of stuff like you can already see some things. Oh, over here, very exciting. The sofa is full of presents. Also, if any of my friends get these presents in the future, you're welcome. But yes, if you know me, I literally just see something online and go, oh, so-and-so would love that. I'm gonna put it away for them. And yeah. Also, thanks to Alexandra, she gave me this idea. Well, she didn't give me the idea, but she suggested the idea of it from other YouTubers. So, thanks, gal. So yeah, pretty much I'm just gonna give you a few ideas of things that I would buy for my friends or family. I know some people are really hard to buy for. Some people say I'm hard to buy for. I don't see how that's possible. I like everything. So another thing is, I bought all this stuff yonks ago. Literally, some stuff is a year old. I buy really far in advance. If I don't remember where it's from, I'm sorry. I will try to link everything in the description below. And I'll try to remember the prices of them. Hopefully. So the first item, items, is for your boozy friend. Cocktails. So this one, I don't know how well this is gonna show up on camera, but this one is an Amazon one. You can get this one's Tequila Sunrise because I love Tequila Sunrise. This is for me. Nobody else is getting this, sorry. So these are not cheap for cocktails. I think this is a 70 centiliter. I don't know what that, how much that is, but get a few drinks out of it anyway. As far as I remember, it's 17 pound a pop. So they're not cheap, but they are strong. That's the point. These ones are ones I got from a cheaper website. I think they're 10 pound a pop. And they do sort of the similar ones like mojito, strawberry daiquiri, don't know if they do tequila sunrise, but I love these. They're such nice gifts. You can put them, wrap them in like tissue paper, put them in a little wine thing and they're like a wine bag, and but they're not wine. Cause I don't like wine gang. Well that rhymed, wine gang, kind of. But I don't, I don't really like wine, so cocktails for your boozy friends also i like giving small gifts so this could go along as a little like if you don't want to just give them alcohol and what a perfect time of year for it hand sanitizers so these were from i don't know bubble tea i bought them online obviously somewhere like i said i'll try to find the link for everything but they have strawberry daiquiri they have a mango one just in case not everyone's an alcoholic like me they have mojito, pina colada, and gin and tonic. So you can always pop them along, like, cause obviously the, the little cocktails, they're not gonna take up the full wine bag. So you can like wrap it and pop it in the top as well, and then they'll be like, oh look, a gin and tonic hand sanitizer. How thoughtful. I don't know how much those were, by the way. And I am giving some of my friends those this year, so you're welcome. So the next two things are from Primark. One I have on my phone right now, I, it is, my Mickey and Minnie, I think Minnie's on it. Yes, she is. Mickey and Minnie case. This is my snappy by the way, it's where you put your socials on it. So it's a new thing, but um, yeah, it doesn't obviously come on the case, you have to buy it separately, but it's not from Primark. But this is my case and look, if the glitter falls when you tap it. And this case was only three pound. Three pound from Primark, three pound. Fits my phone perfectly, it's really sturdy. The only problem with it, I would say, is the lock button. You've got to really push it to get your phone on and off. Little inconvenience, but I love a Christmas phone case. They also have a stitch one. I'm yet to find it, but I want it. 
The next thing's also from Remark are these little bags. This one was a two pack. I've already opened mine and used one. It was £2.50. This is like a Christmassy one. It's reindeer on it. And this is Pink Pony. P E O N Y. Don't know how you pronounce that. Pony, Rose, and Apple. Definitely gonna be pronouncing that wrong. It has a little hook, so you don't even have to. You just take the wrapper off it and hang it up, and they last for ages. This one was £1.50, so the single ones are like £1.150, and the double ones are obviously like £2.50. And again, they have a hole through them, so you can hang them. I just think they're really nice to put in with a gift because a pound, a pound fifty, you open your gift and straight away it's like, oh, damn, that smells good. On that note of smelling good, I've realised a couple of things I haven't brought out. I'm going to insert pictures of any things that I don't have because there is some stuff that I'm going to mention that I haven't got or is already wrapped. So Lush at the moment have Christmas themed like those little bath stick melt things. They have candy canes and they have like an elf stocking with a little foot. And I love them. They just make the perfect like stocking fillers or I don't know what to buy this person so I'm gonna get them these. We're just cute gifts like I love being like oh I'm just gonna put that in as well because it's so cute. I don't remember how much they were but again I will link it below with a price or just link it and you'll see the price. Guys most of these presents are like little stocking fillers nearly so I hope they give you lots of ideas to fill a little hamper of things. The next thing I would say are always a good purchase are little card holders. I also have two of these from Topshop. So these say they eight pound. I'm nearly sure I had a discount code or something when I bought them because I got them for a bit cheaper. But I love these. They also have another color. I think it might have been a pink color or an orange color. But I already have it wrapped and put away for someone else. I also have this one as well. It is currently in its little wrapper. That's why it's so shiny. But it's like a zebra, a orange, a zebra print, but like orange and purple. I love it. It's from John Lewis and it was £10. But I just love the little design on it. So I'm still in little trinkety things and I think the best things to buy people as well are coasters. Who doesn't love a good sentimental coaster? So I have this one that says one friend can change your whole life. And this one that says the drinks are on me. So again, they're both good. I don't remember the price of these. I feel like this is going to be a running theme. I don't remember where I bought it and I don't know the price of it. But if you Google it, I'm sure you'll find it. This next one is a good item for your friend who has a Polaroid camera. If you have a Polaroid camera, you can put a picture in, but it's just a little frame. So this one is like, it has flamingos in the background, but again, it's like my Mickey Mouse case and you turn it upside down, it glitters. And I have quite a lot of these in my room, I love them. This one was £8, so not overly expensive. I think it was from the likes of a sauce or somewhere like that but you can get these everywhere again no idea where i got these but i just think they're super super cute they're maybe good for like aunts and uncles presents i've given them to my friends before because i think they're so cute and i would like them so it's soap it's a bar of soap but on it it says what the flavor is with like a funny thing so this one says it's fate, you and me are meant to be. So obviously that one's a mint. The other one says I'm totally coconuts for you. So I think it must either be like a coconut flavor or like a nut flavor. Not flavor, they're soaps, you don't eat soap. Smell it. So these are super cute. They're just nice again for like little stocking fillers. I know where I got this one and I have it in my present cupboard but I want to keep it. <laughs> it's from Skinny Dip. Skinny Dip do the best little like knickknack gifts. I think I love looking through the accessory sections in shops like Topshop, New Look, all those places. I'm like, let me see your accessories and your gifts, please, because they make the best little knickknacks. So this one was from Skinny Dip. It's eight pound, and it's a little mirror, and it says Skinny Dip, and there's the mirror, and there's the reflection of me in the viewfinder. Magic. This next one's from Paper Chase. It's a candle in a tin. So you just pop open the tin and the candle's in there. This one is Wild Cherry Blossom and it is lovely. It was a point. I love them. I think they're so cute. I also have another one here. I don't know where it's from. I'll find out. But it's gorgeous. It says keep shining please. So you pop it open and it's in there. And it is Jasmine Vanilla. Beautiful. And I have 
someone of mine who's getting this gift this year, so keep your eyes peeled. This person watches my videos, so you're gonna get this in your Christmas present. Next, for anyone who knows me, knows I love this, notepads. I live for a notepad. All these notepads are for myself. I don't gift notepads because then I have to buy double because I want them. The next three are from Paper Chase, my favorite place for notepads. And I love them. Only have the price of one of them, which is six pounds. But I'm sure most of them, they're all pretty similar, so I'm sure most of them are the same. So this one is, hello you beautiful thing. It's got that foil in the front. And they're all lined pages. The next one says, good karma club. And the next one says, yes you can. I just love a notivational notebook. Uh, I just love a motivational notebook. It makes you want to write in them. This next one I actually got local. I got it in Newcastle. And it is from a shop called Once Upon a Dandelion. And this is only £10. And I absolutely love it. It's this little sign. It's a wooden sign. And it says always. Now you can set it somewhere. Or there is a little like carved out bit on the back where you can hang it. Um, and yes, like I said, it's from a little shop called once upon a dandelion and it was only 10 pounds. I just think it's really cute. It's super lightweight, like really lightweight and it's just gorgeous. Again, these are sort of my Christmassy knickknacks. Super good as stocking fillers, super cheap. Most of these are from B&M, like such. Um, so firstly, they have these really cute hand sanitizers in. This one has a gingerbread man on it. There is one with a Santa Claus on it too. I also got this from B&M last year. It's a little cotton candy reindeer nose and it's a little lip balm. I have also got these, which I'm pretty sure for B&M as well, but I don't know the price of it is, guys. I got them last year, but three little bath bombs that are snowmen. So the three little bath bombs and they're just dressed up as little snowmen. Then last year I got these on sale. They were from Accessorize and they were £3.50. And I got them after, I think they were one pound each. They are little hand sanitizers, polar bears, strawberry, yeah, strawberry fragrance. So keep an eye out after Christmas for all these things that go on sale. Like I bought like 10 of these, so everybody is getting one this year in their Christmas as a wee stocking filler, like a wee extra for a pound. So cheap. Have a look. I keep all of my little Christmassy things each year in a little box just these little magnetic fold up boxes and I keep them in my room just stored away so the next year I can be like oh look look at all this Christmas stuff I have perfect for this year half the price the next one I have was actually given to me but I did ask for it I love this I can't wait till I have my own house so I can put it in my house it's so beautiful I don't know where the person got this from but I do have a girl I follow on Instagram. It's called Bespoke Words. I think that's the name of the shop. I will link it down below. I've chatted to her before. She's lovely. She does giveaways and the stuff she comes up, like she'll help you design it. It's beautiful. You can get business ones as well. But this one is like a wired and it says, let's stay in bed. People can get Christmassy ones as well. This girl on my Instagram does beautiful Christmas ones coming up. She had ones that advertised ho, ho, ho. And I was like, I'm in love with them. The next one again is another friend I know. She has a print shop called Fingerprint Designs. Pretty sure that's what it is, but shout out to you, Hannah. And I ordered this beautiful print off her this year. And she got it printed and sent out and it's fashion. And it's like a greeny purple in the background. And I just love it. I love it. I cannot wait to put it in a frame and put it up in like my dressing room makeup area when I have my own house. So I think prints are really good. She does all custom ones. Um, she probably will work with you. At the moment, she's also designing vans. So check her out, I'll link her below as well. Another two things I have here from Oliver Bonus is their water bottles. So this one is just a turquoisey star that says Lucky Star. They're velvet. They come with the water bottle. And this one is Sparkles and it says Champagne Dreams. And again, it comes with the water bottle. They don't have any Velcro or anything, so they're not that safe for kids. But for adults, they're absolutely fine. Now, normally, their water bottles are £24. However, there was a sale on at the time and these were only £12. £12! These are both mine. Sorry, friends. None of these are getting these. Go to Oliver Bonus. 
and buy them. And thank you to Dawn, who I used to work with. She told me about Oliver Bonus, and I've been in love ever since. So next are just a couple of wee things I picked up from the Christmas shop at Donaghy Day Garden Centre. Creative Gardens, I think that's the name of it officially. But if you look up Donaghy Day Garden Centre, you'll see it. So these little stars, it's like a marbly effect. And also got one, these are for my Christmas tree. Again, sorry guys, you're not getting these. But again, they're like really pretty. And they're only 2 99 each, three pound for this. And I'm like, it's beautiful. Like it's a ceramic-y beautiful little decoration. I just think it's gorgeous. Another thing I also got from the garden center, which makes a really nice gift. So this little candle, it says make a wish. And it's just got like a wooden topper. But this little candle, it says make a wish on it in like a goldy writing. It's just super nice for a little gift. I did not get the price and I threw away the receipt because I didn't want to know how much I spent. They also have beautiful cards. Anyone who knows me knows I love cards. Donna Day Garden Center, your cards are the best. I, I literally had a field day in them. I had to drag myself away. They also have a really nice book range. I got a book for my mom. You'll see what it is, a Christmas lint. And I got a couple books for my dad. They do little pocket books and they have kids books. I have one for Sophie and they have a really good range of stuff down there. So if you take a trip, you will be sure to find something for that person that you do not know what to buy for. They also have these gorgeous trinket trays, which I'm just gonna throw out there. Trinket trays, trinket dishes, things like that for your jewelry, great gifts. I love them. The ones in Donna Cadiz Garden Centre, you'll see on my vlog, I did a vlog there for the Christmas shop, but I went and they were like rectangle ones and they were stunning. They were 16 pound, I think, but can you put a price on love? So lastly of the things I have in front of me, I don't know if there's many things I have that I need to put a picture of in, but of the things I have in front of me, lastly, is one of my favourite shops, Luck and Luck. I will link them down below. Their stuff is beautiful. So they do lovely Christmas decorations, lovely Christmas napkins, Christmas holders. They did Halloween decorations. Some of the stuff in my video was from there. They, it's brilliant will find something to give somebody from this shop, I guarantee you. So the most recent thing I bought from this shop is this little porcelain Christmas tree. Oh my goodness, don't drop it. And it just says Merry Christmas on it. And on the back it just has the little star. I suppose it's meant to be like little snowflakes. But it's beautiful. I love the shop. I'm gonna show you everything I bought from there. So this one here says, life isn't about waiting for the storm to pass, it's about dancing in the rain. This one I have bought for myself when I have a house. This one says home sweet home and it's a little white trinket tray. Like I said, I suppose the aim is to put your little house keys in there. I also have ones that say numbers on them. So I gave my cousin a little one that said 21 this year because she turned 21 and it was just a little small heart. I love this one, so this is a coaster. So it's actually got like a soft back and it's a coaster and it says friends are like stars. You don't have to see them to know they are there. Then I also have this one. There are many roads we love to roam, but the best is the road that takes us home. Can't believe we got that first time. But again, it's another little coaster. I love this one. It's another trinket dish. And it says, I love you to the moon and back. My second mummy, Jillian, she's gonna love that one. So they also do Christmas ones, which I think again are perfect for like your aunts, your uncles. Has a little brigade of penguins that say, let it snow. And on the back is the same with the little tree. So this is another decoration. It's exactly like my wee standing Christmas tree, only it's a decorational one for the tree and it says Merry Christmas. So this one's just without the stand and with a little rope so you can hang it up. Then I have another two small ones. So this one says walking in a winter wonderland with a little person out with their doggy, and the back just has some trees, a little moon and some stars. I love the way they're like wrong, like Christmas songs as well. I love that so much. And this one is my favorite, I love it. It says, it's the most wonderful time of the year with two little robins on it. And the back has a little robin on a branch. So 
So guys, go check out their shop, Luck and Luck. I'll link it below. I'll link their Instagram. I love them. I'm so glad I came across them. I think I came across them originally on Etsy and then was like, let me get onto their website right now. I, I love it. Another thing that I love, and I can't show you them because I've already wrapped both of them, but this website called Katie Lennox does the most beautiful key rings. I will show you a couple in the pictures, but they're beautiful. I love them. Another thing I think I got from Luck and Luck are like wine holders, but they're like Christmas wine holders. So they're super nice to give as gifts as well. Another few things I was just going to talk about is gift wrap. Anyone who knows me knows I'm obsessed with gift wrap. But I think a couple places that I like to get my gift wrap from, B&M do massive rolls, like 12 meters for super cheap. And some of them are gorgeous. Half my presents are wrapped in them this year. I also love, love, love Paper Chase. Their craft paper is the easiest to wrap with. Their other paper is gorgeous, but it's slippy. So it's hard to work with. But it is really, really nice. Also, Cox and Cox. Love their wrapping paper. Ridiculously expensive, but it's beautiful. And another place that I love their gift wrap and their bags is John Lewis. And I will give you a heads up, if you buy from John Lewis, they will send all of your parcels in different like packages. It's ridiculous, so ridiculous. But I don't run the shop, so I can't do anything about it. But they do gorgeous rolls of wrapping paper. And there's also so many places on Etsy, guys, you can get personalised wrapping paper, personalised Christmas stickers, things like that. It's definitely worth it to go to that little bit of effort and just make it more special. Also, guys, at this time of year, Disney normally do a sale and Black Friday's coming up, so keep an eye on their website. They do really lovely Christmas decorations and it is perfect for any Disney lover. So, guys, that was my rough gift guide kind of more like gift ideas but I hope you really enjoyed it and stay tuned for more Christmassy content. Bye!